Welcome to this episode of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, we're going to take a look at the SkyZone 700D. So, one of the things in the past when I demoed this uh, unit when I first got it, my idea was to put the uh, old SEMA batteries in the back. But one of the problems is there's some of them uh, won't fit with the cover. Some of them I can kind of get with the bulgy cover and that kind of stuff. And so, what I decided to do was actually print up a 3D carrier to fit on the back and then what I'm going to do is here's the back I'm going to attach it to the back uh, with some screws and so this can mount on there and it'll just sit in here I've got an opening here for the balance connector to come out because I'm utilizing the balance connector and I just stuffed the other one uh, inside here I left enough room in the design and then what I did is I built up an extended balance cable which will plug into the actual unit in here because what I did is I replaced its uh, connector with a balance plug. And what I do is while I'm use, I, using the three wires, have the three wires, I'm only actually using the hot and ground from the outside because this is what uh, provides the 7.4 volts. Uh, and the blue one is actually the balance connector that's in the middle of these two cells. So I don't actually use that one to power the unit. As you can see here, it only has two wires. And then I'm going to use a black rubber grommet to go in the hole, uh, you know, just to make it nice and clean and uh, look, you know, look nice. So uh, let's go ahead and kind of set this up and I'm going to do a quick time lapse and we'll come back and take a look at how it all turns out. Okay, so we've got it assembled. Here's what the back looks like. Uh, so I've got room to put the uh, little bit extra in here. I've got heat shrink tube on here. I tuck this pigtail in here. Um, you know, the nice thing about it, if I need to power something else from this, and because this is uh, 7.4 volts, I could do a step down to say USB voltage and power from this. This is a good size battery. So, uh, um, as you can see, it runs the monitor just fine, and it comes as one tight package. And because of the, we stuffed the pigtail in here, it works out to be a nice size, where that just pressure fit fit holds this. And then I've left enough of this proud right here, so I could grab it to pull it out. So I'm not trying to fish it out, and but it stays there. So really nice, neat, clean. The grommet gives it a nice professional look here instead of just a hole. Um, I would have probably did this a little bit different, and I might redo this a little bit different in the future, but hey, right now it works. Uh, I probably would have gone with a black. This actually came with the um, uh, uh, balance connector, so I just figured I'd use it, but I'd probably use black in the future and probably a little bit shorter length of it to give myself a little bit more bend around this corner. But I do have, um, you know, this right here where I can pull it out, out of the side and I mean, I can actually even run this sort of in there like that, even. So, can do a couple different ways, but really clean looking, and I like that. I'm really happy with it. I can throw it in my uh, travel box and uh, just go with it. And it's all one unit. I set it up. I leave it attached to the tripod stand. You've probably seen me use that. So, uh, hey, this came out really good. So, uh, hopefully I've inspired you. I'm not going to put this out on Thingiverse. It's just a simple box. If you're interested in it, hit me up in the comments below. I'll give you the Tinkercad link to it. Um, again, pretty simple. And uh, just so I can reuse the SEMA X8 batteries here because i got a bunch of them. So, hey, hopefully you found this interesting. Uh, if you did, hey, give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe button is going to be coming up over there. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Helps the channel out. Any comments, hit me up below. And hey, we'll see you in the next video. Cheers.